Yesterday I was listening to an interview um, from Rick Wiles of True News. I'll put the link down below. And he started with a great question. And I'll ask, I'll ask you all the same question if you hadn't heard what, what he said. And don't read and cheat here. How long do you think the plague lasted? The actual Black Death. And he said, take a guess. So I thought in my head, I'm like, five years. And then he said, 200. I thought to myself, wow. <laughs> 200 years. And if you look here in the last sentence, once again, waves of plague continued to come and go for hundreds of years. The actual, when the most people caught it and the most people died, was that first wave from 1347 to 1350. Three solid years of terrible death. <clears throat> where a quarter of Europe's population was wiped out. And it just spread in the Middle East, like, uh, excuse me, the Mediterranean, like nobody's business. Um, and when I hear people talking about Ebola becoming endemic, that's what they mean. Endemic means it's going to cycle through the population, where you have a pocket here, a pocket there. It's never really wiped out everywhere, so somewhere in the world there's always Ebola going on, until eventually everybody catches it and dies, or catches it and survives. And it's going to burn its way through the entire population. So when I heard, when, you, when I heard that the Black Death went on for hundreds of years, that's the first thing I thought of was people saying, or so-called experts saying that Ebola is going to become endemic. It just immediately clicked in my mind. And honestly, I think that's what's probably going to happen. Just the way everything is looking is, you know, the way the media and the government's pounding away at this. It's not going to happen overnight, obviously. Weeks, months, years is what, years is what we're looking at here. You know, the plague took, the Black Death was three years, wiped out a quarter of the population. Ebola, three years, could wipe out 60, 70 percent of the population. Um, and then three years after that, three years after that, three years after that, and it just keeps going and going and cycling through the population never really gets wiped out and the powers to be get to put in whatever things they've been planning. I don't know how else to say it other than this is the end game. This is what they've been waiting for and it's finally released. And we're really in the in the pre apocalyptic elliptic time right now. And three years from now if anyone is still left alive, they're going to look back and be like, wow, that would be a great time to live, huh? 2000, the end of 2014, <laughs> paradise compared to the end of 2017. So before it really gets going, get prepared. Be able to isolate yourself in your house for a month at least and just take as many precautions as you can, be as careful as you can. And most importantly, get your get your shit together. Get your internal situation straight. Get good with the creator, whoever you believe in. Make sure you love your family, pets, your whoever. Just be ready.